Good afternoon, Piscianos. Good afternoon. Happy Memorial Day. I hope you guys are out there having a good meal, enjoying the day with people that you love and that love you back. Thank you to everyone that has liked, commented, subscribed, done personals, and gave donations. I'm forever grateful. Thank you. No personals at this time. I will let you know when I open up again. I think we're winging it. I'm gonna start with an oracle. Let's see what we could pick up. Spirit, angels, ancestors, and higher beings, please help me with this message today for my beautiful Pisces people, my Piscianos. The angel of union. A partnership is blessed and destined for greatness. You know what I just felt here? <clears throat> I feel like no matter what happens in the outside world, if you're meant to be with someone, you're going to be with that person. Um, it, a lot of things can come in between us. Um, I'm feeling the energy of other people. I feel the energy of, you know, circumstances. Like things sometimes get between you guys and then it's like, you know, you kind of drift apart because you have to, because the circumstances here in this world. But I feel like this card is out here saying that, you know, for those people out there that are missing their twin flames, their, you know, their partners, whatever you want to call yourselves, I don't know what it is, but that strong, strong connection that you know that this is your person it's like if you're meant to be, you will be. If you guys are truly what they say you are, you will come back to each other. All right. And in this reading, what I feel is, yeah, this is the people who are destined to be with each other, no matter what happens. It happens. Sometimes you're not with the person that you love. It could be even for years. Next thing you know, you're back together because you were meant to be together. And this doesn't have to just be a relationship, you know, a sexual relationship. This is any relationship. It could be a family member, anybody. You were meant to be with each other. You were meant to be in each other's lives. And you guys are blessed. Together, everything comes together. That's what I just felt. Everything comes together. Wow, look what came out. The lover's card in reverse. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. Wow, what am I feeling? All right. We got the lover's in reverse. I was saying how you may not be with that person anymore. They may be having connections to other people right now. Trust when I tell you that this connection that they have to someone else is very demonic. It's very, um, it's just not the energy you want. You want this lover's energy upright. The only reason it's in the reverse is because you're not with this person right now. You guys are not maybe not aligning the way you should be aligning at this moment. And I definitely feel that it's because of this energy right here. It's this energy of this person um, or maybe a situation Maybe they're tied down by something that they cannot leave. And we'll go deeper into that. We got the strength card here and the five of swords. I feel like someone is not containing themselves um, I feel like they're, oh, 
they're taken Pisces when you're with this devil energy you're just taken and that's I don't know how else to explain it you're just taken um, you don't have you don't have your senses you don't really have control of how to handle things of how to word things you know you just turn into this evil person that kind of manipulates in order to get what they want you know they just communicate mostly for themselves about themselves to themselves you know it's all about them it's a strange energy here of your person is not a good person right now and that's a fact from what I'm seeing they're just not a good person Can they change? This card gives me a lot of hope. This card can tell me that maybe they'll fall flat on their ass and maybe one day they'll wake up. But let's go a little deeper and see what's going on. Tell me more about this lover's card in the reversal. feel like there is a lot of love still between the two of you wow this is the four of cups in reverse period that's all I'm gonna say there's a lot of love between the two of you you just aren't physically together you're just not physically together but there is a lot of love I feel like this person might try to, I feel like one of you guys might be ignoring the other one or you both might be ignoring each other, but either way, um, it's really hard for the both of you because you both feel this genuine love. Why this person then? Tell me more about this devil card. This attachment. Oh, that's what I just said. It's an attachment. This person could be some type of evil attachment a witch whatever you want to call them I don't know but they work for the wrong side it's like they pray for the wrong side Ooh, I've seen say they've done some really bad things The Fool card in reverse and the Ace of Pentacles. Give me a second. I was feeling like they did something really bad. I feel like they lied, cheat, and steal to get their home, to get some type of money or asset. I feel like they're teaching your person how to be a criminal. That's what I just got. They're teaching your person on how to be a criminal. Wow. Your person, Pisces, is being changed by this person. It's like they're being very impulsive with money situations and decisions. And I feel it's from the dark side. Let me get into the strength card. Tell me more about the strength card in reverse. It's like they don't have their senses. They're not really attuned. Like they're not really doing the right thing. It's like they let the beast out. Um, but unfortunately, in this situation, it's kind of like you're doing things the wrong way. It's the wrong beast. The wrong beast. Tell me more about this strength card in reverse. The Hanged Man and the Six of Pentacles. I feel like hold on. There's an image that they're trying to portray right now. They try to portray the image that they help the poor people out and they help the people who have less. Um, like kind of like a Robin Hood feeling that I'm getting. Um, but I feel like it's very calculated. I don't know what it is that they do. I don't know. It's some type of illegal activity. Um, but in reality, they're actually taking from those that are less fortunate. But I, I can't tell you. I don't know if it has something to do with drugs, selling drugs. Um, but yeah, it's like this energy of taking away. It's like they look like they're being like all generous. They're giving to the poor. But in reality, they're really thinking about what they're doing. 
it's very smart. They're actually very um, good criminals. That's what I feel like. They're a good criminal. Whoever this person is that your person's tied to, I get the sense that this person is teaching them how to be a good criminal. Or they both could have been good criminals and now they're really, they're really doing it now, Pisces. Your person, the person you used to know, has definitely turned to the dark side. Tell me more about this page of cups. Who are you talking to? Who's in your intuition? Who's talking to your subconscious? You got the tower. Someone that's trying to destroy your life. Um, I feel like they really don't care. I feel like um, there's this energy of they're going to either make this money or they're going to lose it all and, you know, maybe go to jail or maybe um, suffer some dire consequences. So this person has a really bad attachment and they're going to do just about anything to get that money. They talk to the other side, Pisces. The other side is guiding them on how to make this money. They can't come up with the, these schemes on their own. That's why they're having success in it. Wow. I'm going to throw one more out. Tell me more about this tower card. So they're making a lot of impulsive decisions when it comes to money. Wow, Pisces, you know what's that saying? Sometimes people get taken out of your life because they're headed down a wrong path and God doesn't want you to head down that path. That's the energy that I feel here. That's the energy, Pisces. You're Like one day you're gonna realize why this person is not in your life. And it's gonna be because they might be in jail or worse. Tell me more about this tower card. King of Wands. Don't worry, Pisces. Do you think the devil is committed to anybody? No. The only person the devil looks out for is himself. So that's what's happening right now. This person that your person's with has a wandering eye. Tell me a little bit more about this King of Wands and that wandering eye. You got to look so good. You got to look the part. Wow. And that will be your downfall, the death card facing straight to the King of Wands. That person is facing death, a whole new re, like reinvention or revamping of their lives. That's what I feel like with these with this energy right here. Pisces, I get the feeling that once this person falls to the pits of hell with this other person, they might change because I got this card first, Angel of Union. A partnership is blessed and destined for greatness. So maybe they just need to fall real badly. Maybe they need to get hurt real badly in, in order for them to come up again. So we can get this lover's card right on the on the on the right side again. Because right now they're living that double life. All right. Let's do some advice. They'll do anything for the money right now, Pisces. Anything for the money, for the attention. They're not thinking straight. I keep getting impulsive. Impulsive. Spirit, what advice do you have for Pisces? Advice for Pisces. <laughs> what did I say? 
we're going to try to get that lover's card back up again. That's what I just said, Pisces. Sometimes they need to walk through the fire in order to come back. Don't sit around waiting for them though, Pisces. But in this reading, I feel like they definitely will come back. They just need to really die, hit a wall, get burnt out the building, burn down the building type of feeling by a lot of stupid impulsive decisions that they're making right now. They'll come back, Pisces. All right, Pisces, I hope you like the reading. Please like and subscribe and thank you.